Stacy with As a Tea Brews. Today I have a small haul from David's Tea. I actually ordered this mm, at least two weeks ago, three weeks ago maybe, um, and it did take a little longer than normal to ship, um, but it's been here for a while, but I just haven't had a chance to film this haul video. So it's been sitting in a box and I keep eyeing it, wanting to open it, um, and so I'm finally having a chance to film this for you guys to show you um, what I ordered and I am excited. This is when the fall stuff kind of first came out the first release now They've released more mm, Fall stuff and Halloween stuff and I'm very tempted to order a couple more things but I already do have a lot of fall teas that I really like and so I ended up passing on a lot of the the new ones and some of them didn't sound super appealing to me um, some of them did but I was kind of on the fence so this is what I ended up ordering. Um, what, one thing that I really wanted, I wanted a new fall mug. I've got two super cute fall mugs that I love, but the girls always want them, or my husband wants them, and they go quick, so I wanted another one. There are a couple more, and they have a two for 30 right now Nordic mug deal, and I am tempted <laughs> to order two more, um, but I keep trying to tell myself that I don't need them. That's what we always tell ourselves, right? With this tea stuff. We don't need it, but then we order it anyway. It's like, it's like a sickness. <laughs> okay, so the mug I got, I don't think I've ordered any mugs since they stopped giving the filters with them, but this one is, it's like a kind of a dark green and it's got copper, yellow, and plum colored pumpkins on it and it has a lid with a pumpkin, and then the inside is like a pink. Um, and so this is really pretty. It gives the fall vibes, and fall is my favorite time of the year. I just spent the last two days putting all my spring and summer stuff away, cleaning the house, making peach jam, because I had a ton of peaches on my counter. So I've been very busy the last couple of days doing all things that feel fall to me, and so I'm excited to have another mug to use for the fall. And then, I've been very tempted to take that out and use it, but I've refrained because I wanted to open it with you guys. Um, okay, and then I did get two of, three of the newer teas, and so the first one is Honeycomb Chai. Okay, and this tea is a fruit infusion, which I love because then uh, I do tend to drink decaf teas more often because in the morning I drink coffee and then afternoon, early afternoon, I'll drink uh, a little bit of caffeinated tea, but then I usually like to switch to decaf. So I was excited to see this one and at least one more with no caffeine that I wanted to try. Ooh, this one smells really good. Now I have not seen any reviews on this, so I have no idea if I'm gonna like it or what people think about it. But it smells sweet and cinnamony. And there's something else in there, I'm not sure what it is. Let's see. This one's got apple, licorice, ginger, rose hip peel, candied ginger, cinnamon, natural flavoring, manuka honey, lemon peel, clove, mallow blossom and marigold blossom so this one i am very excited to try i just remembered i had made a cup of tea and i left it sitting on the counter so i had to go grab it mm. this one is s'mores chai and i love this one just plain i have had it as a latte also and it's very good that way um, but just a cup of this plain is delicious it's a uh, sweet just by itself and it's a pu'er so it does have some caffeine but it's got like the smokiness and the sweetness and it's just really good to me. <laughs> I like this one. Um, they do still sell this one, but this is my tea from last year. Um, I still have quite a bit in my tin, so I have not ordered more of this. Okay, so the next tea that I ordered um, is Toasted Marshmallow. And this one is a rooibos, and I am kind of hit or miss with rooibos's, and so I am a little nervous about this one. If it tastes too much of rooibos, I don't love it. Mmm. This one smells really good. This one smells really sweet, too. 
This one has apple, cocoa, chocolate, uh, and the ingredients for chocolate. Rose hip peel, artificial cocoa butter flavoring, roasted chicory root, white chocolate, rooibos cocoa peel licorice root, marshmallows, corn, all the ingredients. There's a lot of ingredients for marshmallows in here. And then stevia extract. Okay, this one's got, it seems like, quite a bit of ingredients and artificial ingredients. So hopefully this one doesn't taste super artificial. Um, okay, the next one that I got is mocha chai. And this one is a black tea, which, as you may know, I don't drink a ton of black tea. Um, but I do have a few that I really like. And this one just sounded um, really good. And so I decided to give it a shot. Hmm. This one smells kind of odd. But I can tell it might brew up tasty. I think I smell the coffee. Well, I haven't even looked at the ingredients. I'm assuming coffee is in it because it's mocha. It smells coffee, chocolatey, and something else. Elephant approved black tea, dark chocolate chips, roasted yerba mate, cacao, chocolate, dark coffee bean, cinnamon clove, ginger. It's a very interesting combination of ingredients, so I will give that one a try and we will see if we like it. Now, one of those teas um, I got with my free rewards, just when you buy $100 worth, you get two ounces of free tea on your next purchase, and so I redeemed that reward for one of those. And then um, they also, when I ordered, had a free, a free two ounce bag of tea. And I think I got to pick from a couple different ones. I picked Sleepy, is it lychee or lychee? I actually, they've had this tea for quite a while and I've never tried it. So I decided to order it and give it a shot. And this one, hmm. This one smells like it would be really good iced. It smells very fruity. But I think that this one's advertised as like a nighttime tea. Um, so then I would like it hot, so I'm not sure. If you've tried this one, if you like it hot or iced, let me know in the comments below. This one is apple, lemongrass, carrot, bean peel, candied pineapple, apple, sweet blackberry leaves, natural flavoring, lime tree blossoms, rose petals, marigold blossoms, and lychee. I don't know how to say that, lychee, lychee. And um, so this one will be fun to give it to try also. And then I just needed to get my order up over a certain amount for the free shipping. Um, and so I ordered two more bags of Lay Digestive. I love this tea. I drink this tea a majority of the times at night when I drink tea. And so does my husband and my youngest daughter really likes this tea. And so, um, we always like to keep this one on hand and I just dumped my last refill before I got these into my tin so um, these will be right on time <laughs> um, and then they also had a free tin which they actually still have going on I went to place an order this morning for a couple things which I haven't decided if I'm ordering or not and I noticed they still have the free tin giveaway and so I picked the hedgehog and he's super cute he's orange and he's just got his little face on there um, and so I, I'm not sure which tea I will put in here, but I will probably try to peel off one of the labels from a new tea and uh, use this tin. So that is my order. Let me know in the comments below if you've tried any of these teas or which one sounds the best to you. And I hope you guys are having a great day. Let me know if you wanna hear more about any of these after I give them a try. I still am working on trying some other teas, um, which hopefully I'll be able to make a video of soon, such as the, I think it was the spring tasting box. I have tried all of them, but one. Some of them I've had multiple times. And I've actually been really impressed with most of the teas in that box. And um, I just haven't had a chance to film a video on that, but hopefully I will get to that because I know some of you requested that. And the new subscription box, their fall one, looks delicious. Um, and I think I've seen really good reviews on it so far. So if you haven't, um, if you've thought about getting one of the subscription boxes, um, it might be a really fun way to try some new teas. And uh, so you might wanna think about doing that. Um, okay, so that is it. Thanks for being here with me and I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.